Hey there, movie buffs. Welcome back to another exciting recap and strategy session. Ever wondered how you'd take down Koro Sensei from Assassination Classroom? It's a question that has intrigued fans for years. Yep, the alien teacher with Mach 20 speed and a smile that never quits. His unique abilities make him one of the most formidable characters in anime. Let's dive into the strategy to defeat this unkillable mentor. It's not just about brute force, it's about strategy, teamwork, and understanding your opponent. First things first, Koro Sensei isn't your average teacher. He's a super being with extraordinary powers. He's a super being with regenerative abilities and the power to destroy Earth. His speed and strength are off the charts, making him nearly invincible. So how do you even begin to tackle someone like that? It seems like an impossible task but the students of Class 3E have a few tricks up their sleeves. Step 1. Know your enemy. Understanding Koro-sensei's strengths and weaknesses is crucial. Koro-sensei has a few vulnerabilities. Anti-sensei weapons. These are specially crafted to counter his unique biology. These weapons are specially designed to counter his biology. They might look like regular knives and bullets, but they pack a punch against him. Throughout the series, you see the students using anti-sensei knives and bullets. These tools are their primary means of attack. They might seem like regular weapons, but they're tailor-made for him. Step 2. Teamwork. This is where the magic happens. No single student can take down Koro Sensei alone. It requires the entire class working together, each contributing their unique skills. It requires the entire class working together. The synergy between the students is what makes their efforts effective. Each student brings a unique skill to the table, from sharpshooting to strategic planning. Their diverse talents are their greatest asset. Think of it as a massive group project with the highest stakes imaginable. Every student's contribution is vital. Step 3. Exploit his schedule. Koro Sensei is a creature of habit and this can be used against him. Koro Sensei is a creature of habit. He follows a strict routine which includes teaching, grading and even personal hobbies. He teaches classes, grades papers and even takes time off for his hobbies. This predictability is a key weakness. Use this predictability to plan your attacks. Timing is everything. Knowing his schedule allows the students to plan their moves precisely. Step 4. Psychological Warfare Koro Sensei has a soft spot for his students. This emotional connection can be a double-edged sword. He genuinely cares about their growth and well-being. This makes him vulnerable to emotional manipulation. Use this to your advantage. Create emotional dilemmas that could slow him down or make him hesitate. It's a subtle but powerful tactic. Create emotional dilemmas that could slow him down or make him hesitate. Distractions and emotional conflicts can be just as effective as physical attacks. Uh, remember, he's still a teacher at heart. His primary goal is to see his students succeed, which can be used against him. Step 5. The final showdown. When everything else is in place, it's time for the ultimate confrontation. This is where all their preparation pays off. When everything else is in place, it's time for the ultimate confrontation. The final battle is a culmination of all their efforts and strategies. Use every resource, every strategy you've learned. This is the moment where everything comes together. The final battle isn't just about brute force, it's about outsmarting a genius. Intelligence and strategy are just as important as physical strength, and there you have it. Defeating Koro Sensei is no easy feat, but with the right strategy, it's possible. It's a testament to the power of teamwork and ingenuity. Defeating Koro Sensei is no easy feat, but with the right strategy, it's possible. The journey is filled with lessons and growth for the students. Whether you're a fan of the manga or the movie, this high-stakes classroom offers endless thrills and lessons. It's a story that keeps you on the edge of your seat. So which student's approach do you think is the most effective? Each one brings something unique to the table. Let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear your thoughts and theories. And don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell for more deep dives into your favourite movies. Catch you next time. Stay tuned for more exciting content.